the tribe. Shout out to the tribes. We are back. Let us the out of Henny Man Battle Rap Trap, and we definitely got the streets. All right, so if you didn't know, man, Hitman Holla and Geechee Gotti actually did another face off on the 100 side show with WAC 100 the other day. It had WAC 100, Joe Button, Cortez, and a couple other people on the panel, as well as Hitman Holla and Geechee Gotti. Now, we got a couple topics from this live right here, man, but I'm going to start it off with all positivity, man, as far as promo and all that. First, Hitman Holla walks in the chat, man, off top. They start asking him certain questions about the sentiment situation. So he kind of retells the story. Check this out. So she called and I, told I, you. Nah, I called her. I just up calling. She she answered the phone like it's crazy. You called me. I checked the cameras. I'm like, ain't nobody on the cameras. I'm like, Ooh, like 20 seconds later, but all I heard boom, boom, boom. So I can't call nine one. I can't call no. I'm out of town. So I just happened to call him. He answered. It's like one in the morning. I'm saying, yo. Man, somebody is in our house, bro. Can you please get to my crib, my girl there? Now, once Joe Budden entered the chat, Wack 100 asked his opinion on the battle and all that, and it starts a little debate. Do you compare the Geechee Hitman um, meetup to? to I can't answer it because I don't, I don't know which one of these is going to show up. Yo, you a Battle Rap fan, but sometimes you just be sounding like a casual, though, bro. I'm, not, I'm one of the only people who... That title ain't nowhere near my name showing up. Whether somebody think I lost or not, you do for a win, man. Yeah, but you do yeah, for a win. That's what I'm man. saying. You that show is, up, but you ain't getting it on the ninth. What, what, you what y'all talking about is more Geechee. Geechee will come freestyle all three yeah. rounds playing and shit like that. That ain't, I ain't me. Give me a link up where you saw Geechee playing. I ain't never seen him play. That, yeah, you might show up every time three rounds prepared, don't choke or nothing. But you ain't you ain't had no you ain't had no dog in you in a minute. My last battle was battle of the year. The whole to you. My, my to me to champion. Yeah. What are you talking about? After that debate, you know what I'm saying? Since both of them, Hitman and Geechee, battle easy to block captain in the same year within months of each other, that turns into a little debate too. Hitman, you you the last battle I went to. You and easy. After that, I got battle of the year. My very next battle after easy. His battle uh, with Ill Will is the same year I battle easy. He get battle of the year when my round getting played all you, over the world. No, he, he, he battled Remy Ma. Remy Ma. He battled Remy Ma. Yeah, yeah. I took Easy. Yeah. Nobody really knew Easy as far as the outside world. He didn't have a million view battle on YouTube or nothing. I got that man a million views in four days. He was able to capitalize off that. Got up there and beat Remy Ma. I give him that. Kudos. He beat Remy <laughs> Ma. This Listen, that's after Pat Poos and knocked the boy out. And also he, he, he get to go up there right all that. And then shout out to Cortez, man. I just wanted to give y'all a clip, you know what I'm saying? He was in there, he was talking the good battle rap knowledge stuff. Check this out. So, so. Cortez, so what you think, Cortez? What Geechee, when he has the T, you're not gonna beat him. Like, holla, you have a lot of controversy. And like I just said, with the T, you know what I'm saying? So I know you're not gonna go in there being naive about that. For for one, I ain't gonna lie, you my man's, but calling it the T is crazy too. Like, nah, that's what like it is. He right. Good job, crazy. Cortez. Yeah. Then it was a little bit more grimy talk. Geechee says Hitman needs to win more. Hitman says I'll walk down your street and take more pictures than you. Me, Geechee, I'm who you think need need to win more? He need to win more. AJ, so you said it's a biggest story if if Hitman beat Geechee, then Geechee fact. got him beating Hitman Hollow. That's a fact. That's a fact. If you bring me out and well enough, they gonna scream my name too. Uh, no, they're not. It's, you're a, you're a big time battle rapper. Salute. I'm a big time person. I walk down Rosecrans and take more pictures than you, bro. And then shout out to Joe Button, man. He just flexing his battle rap knowledge. He says Geechee has more to win. Holla has more to lose. And I kinda understand exactly what he means by that, man. Check this out. Geechee okay, has more to win. Hitman got more to lose. How you figure he got more to lose? Then you. Man, bro. All right, now with that being said, I'm gonna put the link to that in the top comment. Y'all be sure to check that whole thing out. But of course, a little bit of controversy had to come with this, man. Averb actually got tagged in a clip on Twitter. He responds and says, Whack lined him up. He's all LA N words laughing. This is the clip the Verb is responding to. Check this out. GT from Nutty Block, Compton Crip. Shout out to my comrade, Rick Rock. Hitman. Uh, Not the first thing. St. Louis. Louis. St. Louis. But he, he, he. He rep a, a cop the Paru gang. My dudes, I don't, I don't rep the street. Nah, I, I don't know you might. It's too late. Nah, no. they know, but they know, Ellie. I know what you're saying, though. But yeah, you're heavily <laughs> embedded. Yeah, so, for sure. You know, it's kind of like. So now I get up there and I say some. Shit, and it's like it looked like I done dug up. Some shit. 
Everybody know that. Yeah. Averb continues and says, wait, when you on a panel of all LA N-words, you don't pump they gang? Man, Wack is lying to you. They from the West Coast N-words. You see how they looking at you? Averb continues, first you are real takes the stream away from y'all. And little bro says in front of a gang of LA N-words, he is, does not pump an LA gang? God is good. And of course, Byron Blake also did a blog on this titled, Wack 100 in LA press Hitman holler about repping Pyru and he folds. Now, I'm not sure if Hitman was responsible directly to Averb or Byron or whoever, but he definitely took to Twitter shortly after and says, if somebody asks me where I'm from, I'm gonna say from St. Louis. I rep a St. Louis hood. I'm not gonna say I'm from Compton because I'm connected. That don't make sense. St. Louis got our own hoods and politics. I would never claim another city I'm a red rag from St. Louis. Pyru. His man continues and says, to be honest, I feel like when Edwards claim other guys' hoods, people from there never really respect them because it's like you ain't go to our high school, you ain't fight with us growing up, etc. How would you claiming our hood. I always been big on that. I'm from St. Louis. Then Chili Will says, ain't no Chris Bloods or Pyrus originate from anywhere but Cali, so that own hood and politics don't make sense respectfully. The politics are what they are. Pyru Street only exists in Compton, and that's a fact. Him at Holler says, do your research. That ish came to my city. The problem is, we just did things our way. Blue and Orange is a whole different gang in my city. That's different from Cali. Do that mean they fake? Not saying it's the right way, but St. Louis don't rep other streets in other cities. Then Hitman posts a clip and says, I'm always going to be Hitman in any room I'm in. Check this out. So it's my job to let know, oh, he got skeletons in his We, we dealing, when you say skeletons in his closet, we dealing with facts. Man, I don't get up there and just yell, I whack, power root. Then Geechee responds to the original clip that Verb responded to and says, I'm not gonna lie, me and Buttons makes this ish 10 times funnier. Hitman man responds to Geechee and says, I ain't grow up in Compton, I ain't go to y'all schools, etc. I rep a St. Louis hood. The Kali gangs made it to my city though, for sure. And I'm heavily connected out there. If you know, you know. But when speaking on where I'm from, I don't let people not say St. Louis before anything. Wanted to clear that up. Then Hitman dropped three tweets back to back that says, that's why all the real N words respect me worldwide, city to city. I stand on what I stand on and I will never change. Then Hitman says, clickbait YouTube videos that still only do 500 views, laugh out loud. Press 2, get your goofy ass out of here. Hashtag obsessed. November 9th. Then Hitman says, grown men throw hissy fists, don't get punched in the same mouth that you dissed me with. And that's where it stops for now, man. Like I said, I'll put the full two-hour live in the top comments. Y'all should check it out. I actually watched most of it at the airport. I'm going to finish watching it after I edit this video up for y'all. Y'all let me know what y'all think about all this in the comments, man. It's Battle Rap Trap. We got the streets. I see dead people. <laughs> I see dead people. Yeah. They say it's money on the floor. They say it's I see the dead body. people. They say it's smoke on the head. This shit remind me of the trap. Boy. Yeah. I see dead people. They say it's money on the floor. They say it's bitches in the back. They say it's smoke all in the air. This shit remind me of the trap. Where we at? I see dead people.